Okay guys, so in this one I want to actually change some of the coloring and some of the text. So the first thing I'm going to do is change this background color here. And the way we do that, we're just going to go to inspect element. Make sure you have this div tag selected. Scroll down to the jumbotron. And this one looks like it's actually working. So let's grab it. And we're going to change it to let's say like a green color. Let's change the other one to maybe like a bluish color. Yeah, that looks cool. Okay, so let's copy this whole thing here. And we're gonna jump into Komodo Edit and your CSS files, open a new one and call it custom.css. Open that up and paste in those new Jumbotron files. I noticed this one, we wanna change all of these really quickly to this new color and then we want to change all the other ones to this new color as well and this is only just compatibility that's all it is it's just compatibility with other browsers and stuff like that so internet explorer those types of things okay so now we need to actually make sure that this custom.css is installed and we go to our base files here and we have this one so we can go underneath that and just change it to CSS slash custom dot CSS. Um, okay, so save that and then we're going to go into our terminal. We want to do a Python manage py collect static and you say yes. Okay, cool. Bunch of files were copied and moved over. Run the server again. Do a quick little refresh. There we go. Now we have that green green image looking thing. Uh, great start. So let's change bootstrap to what we want to call it. And we're going to call it MVP landing. So that's in the jumbo tron masthead. So we'll call it MVP landing. And we're gonna save that, do a quick refresh. Okay, MVPL, not MVPL, so just MVP. Okay, cool. Um, and let's change this to create your first landing page with Django. There we go, okay, download. No, we don't wanna download it. We want that link so here's the link right here. I'm actually just gonna delete the whole thing and do a href and we're gonna bring this down to our form. So let's call it sign up. Sign up and we want the class to be a button and button success for the style. Let's just leave it as button. Okay. Um, cool. So we can get rid of these links down here too. Let's just do that real quick. Masthead links. We don't need those. Save that. Refresh. Okay. Very good. And introducing Bootstrap. We want to get rid of those things. So div con div marketing. We're actually going to get rid of those. So save it. Do a refresh. All right. So now we have our signing sign up page looking a little bit better. Over here, we want to change onto our home.html. We want to make this a button. And now it says join, it's a button, cool. And remember how we made this being a sign up. So we need to do an anchor tag called a name and call it join. And do a quick little refresh, you click that it's going to bring you down. So if we get rid of it, it will just, well, it's not going to bring you down a whole lot, but oops, that's why, because it's not join, it's sign up. Refresh, and there we go, it brings you down. See if you're up, click it, it'll scroll you right down to that form. So we can change welcome to uh, being join us and there we go. 
Okay, cool. So this is our join us page. So we probably want to change a few things here even. So the Jumbotron masthead, we actually want to call this a new block. Because we're not always going to want the Jumbotron masthead. Sometimes we will, sometimes we will not. Um, so I'm going to take it out. In fact, I'm going to take out the whole thing here and cut that. Okay. So then in here, we're going to do block jumbotron in block. And now that jumbotron's there, save it, save it, refresh. Nothing changes. That's good. Um, now this social stuff, you can change um, if you want. So in this case, I'm going to do, instead of that, I'm going to do codingforentrepreneurs.com. Um, oh, that should be share, not there. So it should actually be not follow, but share data URL. So I'm going to get rid of that link, the follow button link. We're going to get rid of the GitHub stuff. Okay, so now I have the follow or the share. So that's coding for entrepreneurs. It has one tweet. <laughs> okay, so um, cool. So now we have that. So it's not really that impressive where that is. So we'll just remove it. Do a refresh. Okay, cool. So it's coming together. And in the next one, we are going to change. So this stuff's not there. And then we'll add a little pitch video. And uh, then we will re-add some new text and stuff like that too. So it matches a little bit better to what your MVP should look like. All right. See you then.